Uh, Kirana, I'll just get you to introduce yourself. Yeah. Kirana, my name is Katrina Smith. I'm the um, president of uh, Tengarutu Onukuro. Yeah, cool. Um, now, I know there's like um, in Nukuro, you guys are NGO, um, but can you explain maybe just for some people out there that know about, like, I know you have like a not a major problem, but a problem with sand flies here on the island. Um, if you can just talk about that, yeah. Um, yeah, certain times of the morning and evening, um, all the sand flies come out. So we're trying to find a way to minimize the sand flies, yeah. Yeah, so I suppose like for normal people, like mosquito bite is a little bit annoying, but a sand fly is a little bit, uh, bit yeah, more. Yeah, there's a difference with the two. Um, with um, mosquito bites, they'll go away quickly. With sand fly bites, it can turn into like really nasty sores. Yeah, yeah um, I suppose. And how do you guys treat it um, usually? So. Um, we, some of us just don't even do anything, mm. it just goes away because we're used to it. Um, but um, there's uh, baby oil and Dettol, mm. half and half, you put some of that on, or well, um, straight Dettol, yeah, because you, you've got to disinfect it. Yeah, I suppose like some of the young children, I suppose all new tourists coming here, it can be quite bad, like, uh, yeah, do they end up... really bad, it mm -hmm. gets really infected. And it turns into like pussy sores, uh -huh. which is nasty. Yeah, yeah, and I suppose like, is it throughout the year, or is it just, like different times of the year this like comes in or normally, out? Yep. Um, normally there's certain times of the year, but um, um, that they're really bad. But most, like all all year round, they're they're there. Yep. But sometimes, uh, like it's really bad. Mm -hmm. yeah. So like, uh, I suppose like really bad is like people don't want to come out of their houses or was it kind um, of like the situation? No, we still go outside because we have to, yeah. it's, it's quite hot, <laughs> but, but um, it's just unpleasant, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, cool. Um, do you think, uh, like, I don't know, the sand flies were introduced back in the day, so it'd be, um, it's not like a native thing to Mitiaro. Um, um, I, I would suppose it's not, um, it's not native to Mutiaro, it probably was brought brought here by like, you know, soil or, you know, someone's brought soil here. Yeah. Because they live in um, the swampy areas and soil. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And do you think, um, like, maybe just having some kind of sandfly traps would help or all that? Um, yeah. We could try it. Yeah. And I heard with different parts of the world it does work. Mm -hmm. So it'll be really good to try it here in Mutiaro. Yeah, cool. And you think, um, I've seen some like kids with like bad sores and stuff like that in their legs and stuff like that. It's yeah. trying to like uh, just paint a picture for some people out there that are not used to seeing or heard yeah. of sand flies. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. There's there's quite a few children that have um, had really bad sores, and even after months, it's not better. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it just keeps coming back. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's cool. And um, just about your NGO, uh, what are your, some of your goals this year or hopefully um, going forward? So, we're um, in Jan, we're planning to fix or finish our um, playground, mm -hmm. playground wellness centre. So that's on the cards. Um, we're looking at doing some work at the school, um, utilising all the rubbish um, to make a greenhouse. Mm -hmm and um, other little things that the children can probably sell in the future. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, cool. Alrighty. Well, thanks for your time. And uh, any last words or anybody said say anything? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> cool. All right. Thank you for your time.